holistic view of a business and how does a business challenges can be addressed in terms of industry wise because we know that industry is already standardized it has its own process it has a business innovation it has a process innovation it also have a serious technology innovation but an intersection or we call it as an intelligent intersection of all faces is required in terms of any ndfc right so that's where we have taken as in face of faces where the challenge is there how does we as with approach of a cooperative will solve the, these challenges in the industry and as a three i how we are solving this right as a holistic approach so we we understand the traditional traditional challenges traditional operations traditional mechanism traditional approach traditional customer experience and how that as a landscape is setting up for an enterprise here we have channelized about the all forms of an organization in an mbfc so we understand from the investment microfinance as well as the infrastructure so as an organization as a whole scale we start from infra to a revenue based partner for a transformation we does it start there okay we start from an infra how does a series revenue to an infrastructure connection how does a digital transformation goes towards it what was the role of the cognitive as a three end product is it same is it the same nbfc we start i think that five years before is the same nbfc is now and is the same nbfc is going to be for next five years how far we are adapting to the new transformation yes we understand cognitive will play ai will play ml will play but is it really making a sense out of your business how far the entire value proposition of the business comes in as a cognitive right that's where we are tying it into the all formats including our robotic process automations as well as api blockchain all formats please. all formats in 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 the way of bringing up the whole stack of technology the overall impact that what a cognitive can do to an nbfc sector because being using the bus word they get some industry we have seen that an approach wherein okay we bring up a serious cognitive in terms of customer interaction what is the key proposition numbers as a value you get it out of it very simple not only is a structured form we get an we get a very clear insight from the overall as a better for customer experience we understand we info we transform we apply and finally we create a solid impact over the entire yes how do i address a customer <coughs> in terms of contextual experience in terms of connecting the dots to the experience i would say last month to feel my customer has reached out to me for a problem and i have been searching with this all what is the chain link of a connection the next interaction with the customer what might be the right product to sell what is the right pricing strategy for your courier customer what bucket is going to like that does he likes what kind of a brand how to, how to reach it to right entire strategies would be derived from the product perspective we don't leave it we understand the customer in terms of security also because since we know your view we know your patterns of your sales we understand the entire interactions of the identity management that is a key as a security part we ensure that you are being there in terms of approaching with your data a transaction ability happens in four ways in terms of is of a customer right what kind of a customer do i like an apple series do i like an okay series or any format of a bucket you're trying to come and resolve problem right the more you know about your customer is going to be more easy to sell things that's the bottom line more you know about your customer more easy to sell things more how how far i can go to my customer that's my customer is really able to engage and interact with any forms of an experience that as an organization as an mbfc we are providing yes finally especially on the customer motivation where that's where the clean up of upsell process or dynamically connecting the customer for a different start why because let's assume that we understand the customers right not only with in terms of 
groups, segments, you know, also understand the behavior pattern, rate of transactions, nighttime behavior, late bloomer, all facts, and approach individually cases for every every perspective for us. Like one is if I know my customer, I can re-strategize my entire product issue. Right? When I want to disrupt introducing the product as an NBFC guy, if you think that, okay, is it going to fall under an existing product or an existing structure which is already standardized and used or a key business innovation running into the product, product by moving your customer to an extreme, extreme way of sensing the customer, right? Last of this, how do I engage to a digitalization to a low cost? Because when I, whenever, most of the things you think that, okay, when I want to move for a digitalization uh, cost saving, okay, what kind of an investment? What is the value proposition as an NBFC? I'm going to What is the ROI that definitely is going to so what I say, as an organization, we are, or we are envisioning the way that as a revenue sharing model in terms of transition and make sure that this is. Yes, what, what, what might be the experience of an index, customer experience? Very simple, enhanced performance in terms of decision making. That's the key card because every time the decisions they made on every moment when it comes to human being, it is still by 27% that the entire, entire community front and organization care I would change. Delayed decisions always equal to the decisions made in the wrong. So key is streaming decision making would be the key point. Second one is confidence. Because stakeholder confidence in terms of I know my customer, I know what is happening in my organization, I know what to sell, what not to sell specifically, and what is the right time to sell, and the right option of selling, including the cost factor. Operational efficiency, because as an MBFC, we operate from different, different areas. Uh, I say that thousand, thousand points, thousand, thousand action items, thousand of units and people of them, all hubs are there. So, operational efficiency is a key way where we have to look for an entire transformation. Last one is engagement experience. Uh, I see that people covering that everything in the app, everything because uh, last last decade, the entire mobile, I would say the industry transformation was towards mobile app, right? We had everything available in the app, but is it still engaging? Is it still engaging as, as an entertainment platform? Because a platform which is not engaging, which is not Connecting to the customer, people will never spend their time with you. So, more like, more like any banking institution, engaging customers with the app is fine, but what is the right material to make it up? Because just because engaging doesn't mean that he's happy. Bringing back to the basics, where end of the day the customer is key. We have to understand the heart of the customer. I would say, uh, bringing back my own notion uh, in Incom, we call it as we ship products before even the products are purchased. How does it happen? Because we understand that this guy has a 99% probable or 90% probable to buy this product in the next six days. Right? More we are proactive in understanding a customer, more increase in the value. Straightforward marketing, I think it's a simple science of understanding a customer in terms of the behavior, nature, expectation, all. And also keen on seamless personalized touch. Because most of the time, help and the timely help in terms of understanding a customer is more. So 24 plus, plus seven interaction that can be if it is a cognitive present, will be more channelized, more interactive, more engaged end of the day, the customer attention is cut off, right? Because most of the time, the customer attention will be the key challenge for any organization in terms of expansion of business. Yes, more we know, more attention is less, we can make up the retention strategy better. If, if I understand my customer, if I am engaging my customer, right? The current, one of the surveys is 22 percent is the current recommendation that a customer recommends to be another. Because most of the time, banking trust plays the card. My friend is using this bank. 
my relative is using this band my engagement is using or say my organization my my, my entire community is using the band that's where the approach is the reliability and the loyalty of the customer is the key card when you increase that referral of the customer which is in turn a clear value proposition will move up from 21 to 69 this is a survey based by cartman how how do we strongly make up a customer retention yes five areas loyalty efficient engagement reward programs and customer satisfaction the thing we do is when i say loyalty it is not about simply running a loyalty program it doesn't work because uh, no more a business works by us no more a business works by us right we understand to run a simple loyalty program an engagement portfolio right you cannot sell i would say that you cannot sell to a customer in terms of right product to a wrong customer or a wrong product to a right customer bringing back loyalty rates where that will be the major part and especially understanding the customer behavior no more i would say the relation uh, relation perspective property we call it as uh, uh, in complete terms we call it as the graphical view or as a relational view perspective in terms of a frequency relation for each activity we have yes efficient engagement channels we as for great let's assume that 100000 customers we have how does know that previous interaction happened what was the pulse rate of an interaction what is the interaction by agent happened from a, from, a, from a contact center perspective from a sales perspective what was the engagement happened do i have a single kind of customer portfolio to make ensure that the next interaction what is the right question to be asked if you should indicate it as an impulse itself right that's the year that you are entire public is start to give and to do it what are the five points to discuss who are my top 100 customers to make up the going for who are my top 70 customers who are going to sell yes since your customer portfolio is a 360 degree customer portfolio is ready you should able to make it why a profitable customer experience is the car right not only a customer experience how do i make it as a very clear profitable one one is on the personalized and contextualized right similar to when i want to put it in a simple term right you search for a product and the product will search it behind you when you write that's what happens in your company call similar way your customer experience can be english arrive right average call handling time yeah before even you are attending your customers call you know you might infer what he needs you should infer what he needs to take the right call at that moment because he is reaching out to for your clients or any concerns that is a moment so before reaching your customer the readiness of yourself will play a major role that's where the entire business strategy of company will help you knowing the customer individual customer need right that will help you to make up the Entire sales team of the customer, because the entire customer portfolio will help you to retain the customer life and value across all specific omnis and especially any current customer engagement aspects. Keenness, competitive advantage, advantage in terms of complete engagement, in terms of digital transformation, as well as bringing up the heart core. 360 profile of the customer will, will change the cards of designing the products, designing the organization. because we call it as a reverse engineering pipeline based on needs of a customer that and our organization can be driven yes what are the foot steps to take it a serious part of for a digitalization and security yes on is on the technology second on the information or on the business fourth on the consumer trend finally on the economic trend also so all five factors will have a clear perspective holistic view which is that is to be an approach of engineering can you ask that that will a product will do it okay or a solution will do it or an orchestration of a solution will do it or uh, how do i how do i solve as a holistic by have a pathway towards a, let's say that within 5 years my vision is that fully transformed organization and less decision making by a human 
and transforming into an entire inferred decision making through a data makes you a very low risk organization at any point. Thank you guys. So, and uh, you can connect us. If you scan this QR code, you can connect us.